we're going to get a check of the weather. We have Dylan in for Al this morning. Hey, Dylan. Good morning, guys. And we've got some rain falling through the middle of the country. And this is going to be the story for the next several days. We have the remnants of Gordon pumping in the moisture and a stalled front. So 27 million people are at risk for flash flooding when you get some of these heavier downpours. And when you factor in that through Sunday, we could see as much as five to seven, even up to 10 inches of rain. That could lead to some flooding back through the upper Midwest and through the Ohio River Valley. We're also tracking the tropics. This is Tropical Storm Florence. At one point, it was a Category 4 hurricane. It's weakened a lot because of the conditions it's running into, but as it continues to move westward with water temperatures at 85 to 90 degrees, it will uh, re-strengthen, although the track and intensity are still very uncertain right now. So we'll have to watch it as we get to the middle of the week. And then if we look at the extended version, the ensemble models, a lot of the European models take the storm into the southeastern United States. The American models tend to take it a little bit farther to the north. This is so far out in the future. We're looking at the end of next week, but it is certainly worth watching as we go through the weekend to see what this ha what exactly happens as the storm reintensifies. That's a look at the weather across the country. We'll get to your local forecast in the next 30 seconds. Thank you, Kristen. Let's go over to Dylan. She's in for Al this morning. Got a check of our weekend weather. Good morning again, and it is going to be a wet weekend for folks in the middle of the country. Starting off today, we do have a, a chance of some flooding from St. Louis down to Little Rock because of the heavy rain that's moving in. It's stalled along a front, and we've got the moisture from the remnants of Gordon continuing to produce some heavier downpours. As we go into Saturday, that risk extends into south-central Illinois and central Indiana, where we could see some of that flash flooding with up to perhaps six inches or more of rain. This will continue to move eastward as we go through the weekend. It's right along this frontal system where we will see the heaviest rounds of rain. And then as we go into Sunday, it moves into eastern Ohio and western Pennsylvania. This will continue to uh, move into the northeast as we get into Monday and Tuesday. We're keeping an eye on the tropics. Earlier, we talked about Tropical Storm Florence. Also want to point out these two areas of note. These have a 90 percent chance of developing into a tropical system. This is normal. This is when we get our most active weather for uh, the hurricane season, but there is a good chance these could develop into storms over the next five days. That's a look at the weather across the country. Now here's a peek out your window.